I have been playing the drums since I was in fourth grade. I like to think that I can make whatever sound is necessary. I probably can't do it right away, but my philosophy is if you learn as many sounds as you can and learn how to play as many sounds or fit into any genre of style of music or whatever the requirements, if you can make any sound possible or you can figure out how to make the sound, then you can play better in any genre, period. I've had a much more classical music training. Being able to look at something, figure it out, uh, or just be able to copy and paste past experiences from, like, say, another genre, it could get cool. I don't know. Well, my name is Alex Woodside. I am a junior here at UNL, and uh, I have been playing drums for about seven or eight years. Uh, after my junior year, when I, I met Ben Coleman, who was the former uh, drum line instructor here, he wasn't just a drum teacher. He didn't just teach us how to play drums better. He really taught us how to be better people and, uh, and built, built character in us, which was, I think, one of the most inspirational things to me that, you know, I could use drums as a platform to, you know, build people, not just drummers. The thing that keeps me motivated right now is, is really, first of all, the people. There's incredible people that I've met through percussion instrument playing and, and drumline specifically. I've just met a lot of really incredible people both in the state and out of the state. And it's really built those relationships that, you know, have lasted a long time and I expect to last past college. So um, if I had to describe my sound, I'd describe it as it's more or less just kind of the elements of reggae and jam and mixed with um, like bass and dance music and hip hop. So it's kind of just like genre blending. So I take what I like from each element of genres and then blend them. So the main difference is uh, live drumming. It's just uh, you can only do so much live. Your drummer, I mean, it's a human, so they can only do so much where with digital drums, you can program different settings too. So essentially, one, it's perfect. It's my drumming with the digital drums is always gonna be on time. It's never gonna mess up. And two, I could do a lot more complicated rhythms that I would never dream of being able to do with a real drum set. It's just like, I feel like I have a lot more creativity with it because I don't have to battle with anybody over creativity ideas. Which, but with um, electronic music, especially doing it on my own now, it's, I guess I just have full creative control and that's really nice being a musician, so. Jazz can be very technical, and uh, but it can be beautiful at the same time, you know, because there is a lot of different techniques that are utilized, um, different interpretations of things, and, and it's just a it's it's challenging genre of music. I think across the board, regardless of the instrument, you know, just like your heart keeps you pumping, it keeps you going. You know, the drums essentially helps do that. You know, I've played for ten people. I've played for a thousand people, you know, so I've played dive bars, I've played um, performing arts centers, you know, so um, internationally, you know, domestically, so it's pro provided me a lot of experiences, a lot of opportunities. You know, the musical experiences that you get when you perform in a group with, you know, eight other people specifically that play the exact same part at the exact same time, and when you get that moment when it all blends together and just lines up and everything just opens up. It's, it's a really incredible experience. So, you know, those experiences, however few and far between they are, um, are, you know, a great motivational tool to really feel that success of, you know, putting in work, you know, getting together with others, putting in more work, and then having everything just lock in together is really, really awesome. I definitely think that I will be a drummer for the rest of my life. I can't see myself not playing drums because I mean, it doesn't have to be my career per se, but as a pastime, I will never stop. It's too fun, you know? Why stop something and have fun? It's, it's, I encourage it to anybody if you're interested in any instrument, whether it be drums, piano, bass, guitar, singing, anything, you know, I really encourage them if that's your passion and you really enjoy doing it, it's not work to you, then that's something you should probably uh, focus your attention on.